the Japan Air Self-Defense Force, or JASDEF, hosted an awards ceremony on Yokota Air Base to recognize the contributions of U.S. and JASDEF service members to the missile defense mission, a mission that often goes unnoticed. More than one threats that are out here. Because, you know, they're, they're doing a, a mission 24-7, nobody's really paying attention to it unless a missile gets launched, and, uh, and then, you know, we've got to ensure that they're ready. So in order to be ready, uh, they've got to be doing their mission all the time. And so uh, I think this enhances uh, the awareness for others to realize that, as well as, uh, you know, because we do, do do it with the Japanese and the Americans, uh, it, it shows that, you know, this is a, a combined fight that we have to do together. A special acknowledgement to my good friend and the host of the... They run and operate probably one of the most complex weapon systems in the Pentagon and known to mankind. They're able to track and uh, discriminate objects going 17,000 miles an hour and be able to target something within a centimeter of that target and hit it with another piece of metal going the same direction. The recipients caught passes from former NFL player and Missile Defense Advocacy Alliance Chairman Ricky Ellison as a symbol of their role in safeguarding their nations. What they do is intercept incoming objects ballistically. So that kind of, you know, we're throwing the football, it kind of represents a ballistic object that they have to intercept and track. So that's a little bit of that in that. And obviously with my football background, it's something fun and I think that they enjoy it and they enjoy getting the ball. Petty Officer Phil Stewart, Yakota Air Base, Japan.